racing. Steph being Steph, fast away from the inside gate. War Heroine and the Hot Pink is looking for the lead. Just a smidge right down the outside. Win the war within a length and a half of the early pace with Midnight Bisu. Then yesterday's news, Aliana, just three lengths covering that group. A long way clear of street with no name to the five-eighths pole and War Heroine in front. War Heroine from Midnight Bisu. Steph being Steph along the inside. Win the war splits runners in company with yesterday's news. And just a smidge is travelling very wide to the half mile. Followed by Aliana drafting in behind a wall of horses while five lengths off the lead and a gap of six lengths street with no name. Narrow advantage for War Heroine into the turn, half a length from Steph being Steph, who was probing a rail opening, but War Heroine easily and smoothly travels clear again. Steph being Steph, hard pressed on the inside. It's coming through yet again to attack, but is hard pressed to do so. Now they're level pegging. A length in front of Win the War with a quarter mile to go. Another length to the maiden, Midnight Bizu, four deep on the swing for home. And they're followed by yesterday's news. When the war is starting to come through the pack at the eighth pole, Steph being Steph, Midnight Bizu, win the war getting to third in the middle. It's Midnight Bizu taking up the lead with a 16th to go, moving away from Steph being Steph and win the war. Midnight Bizu. Midnight Bizu scores by four lengths. Second, win the war or Steph being Steph from yesterday's news and Aliana finished fifth. Midnight Bisu, breaking her maiden in spectacular fashion, taking the Grade 2 Santa Inez stakes for Bloom Racing Stable and Allen Racing. Midnight Bisu, a dark bay or brown daughter of Midnight Loot and the repent mare, Diva Delta, bred in Kentucky by Woodford Thoroughbreds. Trainer Bill Spar registering a double this afternoon. Mike Smith is the winning rider. Mr. Tim Ritvo with the trophy presentation for the Santa Inez Stakes. Well, the road to the Kentucky Oaks runs through California, 10 points towards that race, and it was won by Midnight Bizu. What a way to break your maiden in a graded stakes. Owner Jeff Bloom from Bloom Racing, Mike Smith, the trainer, Bill Spar. Now, Mike, you got some instructions from Bill leading up into this race the first time you were on her. What were they? You know, it was just uh, one simple thing that he told me. He says, don't, don't be surprised if she's a whole lot closer than you, than you would think. Uh, she's pretty sharp, and it's okay if she is. And I was really glad he told me that because... I was up there pretty close and kind of thought I was there too close and still hit the front a little soon, but uh, she's a really, really good mare and she wants every bit of seven eights and farther. Great ride. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, Jeff. Thanks. Jeff Bloom, what an experience. You guys, I could hear you in the stands as you were cheering. How does it feel? Well, I lost my voice, I think, but it feels pretty darn good. Not a bad way to break your maiden. And you know, this filly, um, Bill's been so patient with her. She's exhibited so much class and and, and maturity, and, and so we really felt that she deserved to be in a race like this, and, and wow, Mike, Mike just, he gave her a great ride, and that was a lot of fun. Very fun, congratulations to you guys. Thank you so much. Midnight Buzu, winner of the Santa Inez at Santa Anita Park.